What's up guys, in this short tutorial I will show you how to fix the connection failed error you are getting while playing or when starting Genjin Impact on your PC. This should be quite an easy tutorial, but if you still have any questions then leave a comment and let me know. First, make sure that your firewall is not blocking parts of the software. Search for firewall to open up your firewall and network protection system settings. On this window, select to allow an app through firewall. Here, select Change Settings and then allow another app. Select Browse and your file explorer will open up. Navigate to the drive on which you saved the game on, Program Files, Genshin Impact, and here select the launcher application and select Open. If the problem persists, then the error is caused by the game's server or your own network connection. As there is an influx of new players at the moment, this error is often caused by the game's servers. That's why I would suggest you to change the server location. This will tell you whether your own connection is at fault. Next, open up your task manager. Here, navigate to your resource monitor, as you can see in the video. In the network tab, open the processes with network activity. And after a few seconds, you will see every process using your network connection. This might be your browser running in the background, Steam, or a download bottlenecking your connection. I suggest you to only enter processes which you know won't break your operating system. Below, you can also preview your network utilization in percent. To test your connection, visit speedtest.net. A link will be in the description below. A normal upload and download speed without interruption is important to properly play online games on your PC. To better your connection, I suggest using an Ethernet cable for best performance. If you need to use a Wi-Fi connection, then make sure to restart your router or modem if you haven't done this in a while and reduce the amount of devices connected to the same network. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.